Noir is a 2011 video game developed by Team Bondi and published by Rockstar Games. And this is basically Grand Theft Auto set in 1940s Los Angeles. You play as an L.A. cop just trying to make it on the force. There's some amount of shooty gun guns, but it's mostly looking for clues, interrogating suspects, driving around the big open world, wearing a hat. It's really good. At the time, the graphics were cutting edge, especially the realistic facial expressions. Today, the faces are a bit uncanny. Eh, it's fine. Today's math prop appears towards the end of the game in the case called A Polite Invitation. There's some convoluted puzzle where this guy in green explains that you need to divide some big number by 90,000. Come over here and use this adding machine, he says. And there it is, a cranking mechanical adding machine. It's not based on a specific real machine, they just made it up for the game. This game is set in 1940s LA, and this machine looks a lot like a Burroughs or Victor machine of the time period. A black metal case with a green fingerboard and black and white octagonal keys. They really designed this thing to look authentic, so at a glance it fits this setting perfectly. The way this thing works though is totally wrong. Here, I'm supposed to type 1876988. As I type the numbers, they appear in the display up there and shift over to the left as I type them. No mechanical adding machine ever worked like this. A classic 10 key machine didn't even display the numbers as you type them. It's just too complicated mechanically to make them appear and shift over to the left as you're typing them. After a moment you'll realize that this thing is designed to work just like a modern electronic calculator. Like there's a plus button. On a real period machine to add two numbers you type one in then you turn the crank then you type the second one in and turn the crank again. This one you type a number, then you hit plus, then type another number, then turn the crank like it was a calculator equal button. I guess the game designers are trying to take it easy on the player, like everybody knows how to use a modern calculator, so let's just make it work like that. But this is all part of a dumb convoluted puzzle. Why not make a realistic machine and then figuring out how to use it could be the whole puzzle, huh? Here's something cute, if you do a 0 minus 1, the answer rolls over to all 9s, which is actually what would happen on an old machine. But look at those multiplication and division buttons. A multi-digit long division with a single turn of the crank? No mechanical instrument then or now could ever work like that. The game also has some nice, realistic looking old cash registers. This green guy also has this thing on his desk, which has a crank and sliders rather than buttons. It looks like it's based on a check writing machine rather than an adding machine. But this isn't a payroll office, so it doesn't really fit there. In conclusion, I give LA Noir my math props rating of bad. Thanks for watching, and let me know if you see any more.